Secretary Anwai Guru uh, be probed further and even be denied a chance to hold any public office. Uh, she says this is uh, nothing out of the ordinary. The MPs are also demanding that Senator Kichumba Murkomen be prosecuted over the National Youth Service scandal and that Central Bank uh, Chief be put under investigation. I want to request uh, my director Ombese at this point, if you have that clip, please Ombese, uh, just run it for us before we look at how uh, the Daily Nation has covered this story on page 1 and 2, the Standard on page 2, and the Business Daily on uh, page 1. Looks like uh, the um, finally tabled the special audit report on the loss of billions of shillings of NOIS funds through grand theft. The report of the Public Accounts Committee. Top on the committee's recommendations is barring former devolution cabinet secretary Anway Guru from holding any public office if found culpable of leadership failures. Waiguru is eyeing the Kirinyaga governor's seat on a jubilee ticket. The House Watchdog Committee also wants the anti-graft agency ESCC to conduct a lifestyle audit on Waiguru and other top devolution ministry and NYS officials between 2012 and 2016 and the outcome made public by the end of this year. But Waiguru in a rejoinder termed PSC's findings obvious and not unique to her since all Kenyans had a right to due process while Guru maintaining her innocence. PSC has also recommended similar action against former devolution and planning principal secretary Peter Mangiti who is facing corruption charges. PSC has also recommended further probe and blacklisting of companies associated with businesswoman Josephine Kafura, a self-confessed key beneficiary of the NYS loot and similar consequences for Ben Gethi, another prime suspect in the NYS scandal. The committee also wants the Kenya Revenue Authority KRA to review Gethi and Kafura tax returns. Everybody was very anxious about it and now it has stabilized. Also recommended for prosecution is Central Bank Governor Dr. Patrick Njoroge, PSC seeking to have him slapped with abuse of office charges for either failing or refusing to advise the government on abnormal payment requisitions from the ministry and NYS during the audit period where 25 billion shillings worth of contracts was transacted. Algeo Marakwet Senator Kipchumba Murkomen could be charged with aiding and abetting money laundering with his law firm being cited among beneficiaries of the NYS loot, a recommendation he dismissed. I made very uh, damning uh, 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 revelations about some of the members of the Public Accounts Committee that approached us for bribes. And as I said and I keep saying, the Public Accounts Committee of National Assembly is a toll station uh, for collecting bribes and campaign goodies for uh, members of parliament who are extremely under pressure, including the chair who is running for governor. PAC has also asked Director of Public Prosecutions, Kiriako Tobiko, to reconsider his decision not to prefer criminal charges against former NYS Deputy Director General Adan Harake for the theft of 695 million shillings. Harake had claimed that his password was stolen, but the House Committee held that no evidence was presented. The consulting house, owned by political scientist Mutai Nguni, has been recommended for further investigations and prosecution for alleged collusion and a probe on how the firm received more than 100 million shillings shillings from the ministry and NOS during the audit period. 30 banks and 196 companies that traded with NOS during the audit period have been recommended for investigations. The PSC report will be debated by the House and if adopted, its recommendations will be forwarded to the relevant agencies for implementation. Parliament can amend the report or throw it out altogether. Francis Gashuri, Public First News. A detailed uh, report by our senior reporter Francis Gashuri on the NY scam and uh, the possible deliberations and decisions by the Public Accounts Committee. Now, on the uh, second, on the Daily Nation page two, uh, a, a small snippet there it says uh, the committee says. The country may have lost 23 billion shillings in the NYS scandal. Uh, Senator Kipchumba Murkomen says we are victims of this incompetence and un unschooled behavior because we became firm and forthright without being compromised by the committee. Just as, as, as we were following that, uh, that, that report by Gash uh, Francis Gashuri, we were asking ourselves here, why yeah. is this NYS thing blowing hot and cold? Vincent, I start with you. 
at some point we thought it had taken a lull then all yeah. of a sudden it's blowing up again uh, I, I think we we you, we have to appreciate that uh, the current discussions on what will be the organizing question for our politics for 2017 and i've repeated uh, previously in this uh, platform that uh, a possible organizing question for the opposition is a uh, inclusivity uh, you s that's why they mentioned that this is a government of two communities the message there is that hey the rest of you uh, the uh, only out. place you have in NASA uh, that card is on the public domain the next card is also the issue of corruption that's uh, that's why you hear that all oh, we have one of the most corrupt governments you know all those discussion is to zero down to uh, <coughs> the only way to for us to do away with Jubilee for example is maybe uh, play the co uh, corruption card now what is the easiest thing to to what the, the easiest thing to, to put on the table is the whole issue about uh, the the um, NYS uh, Eurobon might sound to be complex for example if uh, if you and the, it's not been it does not resonate yes, with the so but when you talk about yeah. NYS and people seeing the young man it, it can easily be people can relate with it so you cannot rule out the fact that uh, we are in a, an election year and the organizing question is in the formation mm -hmm. and the easiest punchline is uh, the issue of the NYS mm -hmm. now uh, just to take it a step further because uh, but NYS uh, I, 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 from from what we hear, what has been reported, what's in the corridors, is that it, it almost cuts across the board. There are people on the, the opposition, there are people in the government. Do you really think the opposition would take this as the organizing question? Uh, I, I th the, the, you see, the, con the conversation on the organizing question is not yet complete, but you can see very clearly uh, what are the issues that are on the fore as far as the organizing question is concerned. Point out that number one is the issue of inclusivity, number two is the issue of uh, corruption. Now, because you have to have one thing that galvanizes your base as you move towards the election, and the easiest thing currently when we talk about corruption is the issue of the NYS. Now, that element of um, that it cuts across is uh, confirms what uh, Professor M uh, Makao Mutua said that if the opposition will have corruption as the only issue again is Jubilee, then, then they will they have lost the yeah. election. So, you, we tell tells you that another issue might actually emerge as the organizing question mm -hmm. moving into the next election. Uh, Churchill, uh, I, I I think um, the whole thing of, of of using this to bring out at the national level as you believe as a corrupt regime and having swindled funds that was meant for the youth, well it has worked somehow in the perception of the minds of Kenyans. But then at this stage, why this story will come at this time? I think there is quite a lot, some other intrigues to do with her running for governorship. Uh, gubernatorial position Absolutely. in Kirinyaga. Yeah, because, I mean, some of her opponents at the county level can actually work with the opposition to tarnish her name. Ah. So it's more of my interest, it's, it's not my party's interest absolutely. or my coalition's interest. Because it seems like, I mean, he got some leverage in terms of getting the, the ticket for, for the Jubilee Party. And so how do, we, how, do, how, do we, how do we ensure that this does not happen? Let's tarnish his name. And if he gets, like my colleague was saying, that he's already gotten clearance from ESCC because of, of political uh, connections or something, then we say, I mean, this was in bad taste. And it's not going to work well with our country, I, with the county. Mm -hmm. But then, think about it. You know, just objectively thinking, I strongly believe that this is something that ought to have been done way before. I mean, why do we as a country want to use politics to define how we bring sanity to our institutions? Mm -hmm. if, if we knew so well that these people should be probed because they have embezzled funds, must you wait for election time? Are we, are we seeing incompetence yeah, on the yeah, part of yeah. the yeah. parliamentary uh, 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 committee? Charles, Charles, uh, um, uh, the, the all roads lead to the hill, and um, and one of the thoughts that I had actually Churchill has also emphasized is that right now we are going to be seeing a lot of uh, victimizations and people branded uh, uh, poster boys and poster girls of corruption and negative vices, simply because remember, at the 47 counties, there are 47 billionaires, mm -hmm. and there are also counter millionaires. We are also running this campaign. So if the uh, court coalition or NASA brings somebody who is going to be your opponent, then you are just going to be joining in the fight. And sometimes we may not even place our fingers on who is even bringing this. Mm -hmm. And the second thing is, uh, Charles, 
it's very sad if our institutions can be operating this way because for once I'm not I'm not supporting corruption but for once I may stand with Anwar Guru. Did you have when, huh? you, say, when you say for once? Just for once. For once, what I mean? Yeah. For once, I want to support her. Ah. In terms so of your for once is with standing yeah, with, yeah, with yeah, Anwar. And, 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 and not, not I'm standing with her in principle. Yeah. Yeah. That's right now because of elections, we'll just be churning cases and institutions coming and reacting simply because it's the elections. What also what Churchill has said. Yeah. Why didn't we follow these due processes and make sure if Anne should be behind bars, I would support it. Um, but 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 why do we want to lull it and we want to use uh, uh, this when it's convenient? Yeah, when it is conven convenient. We'll come back to this. Good I, want, I want us to hold it right. I hope you're not. You're not. I, no, no, I, just, just you want to be the <laughs> <laughs> You're I, I, I was thinking. Just hold it. Uh, just hold it, <laughs> gentlemen. We are taking a short commercial break. We'll be back right after this and delve more into the Anwai Guru, the National Youth Service scam that has uh, been uh, very widely covered in the dailies today and later on in this uh, news review segment. We'll also be looking at uh, NASA politics. Uh, the response from the coast after the president's trip, uh, the reactions in Wiper, and of course the reaction all the way from Washington, D.C. Uh, the state of the nation address according to the opposition by the opposition leader, Raila Odinga. Oh,